Price, and I came here today because I was really concerned about the targeting the government was doing on certain groups. I think any time the government singles out a group to penalize them for their thoughts and their beliefs, we have a tyrannical government on our hands, and it needs to be addressed while we still have civil liberties and freedoms in order to do it with the First Amendment and the Second Amendment and all the others. So that's why I'm here and why I believe everyone should care and should be here too. Liberty and freedom, we have nothing. Those bozos up in there have not a clue to what they're losing. Freedom gone for us is freedom gone for them. Do you believe we're here in Washington again? After 200 years, the Americans have to come to Washington to beg for their freedoms. Let's hope that we don't have to come here over and over again to get the message across that this government is a gangster government and does not run by laws. Please, all you Americans out there, please act now and bring this, this government to its knees and bring freedom back to our union. Hi, my name is Ryan, and I'm here today because I'm really concerned about what's happening with our country. and. Um, Quite frankly, I don't want to be here. It's kind of an irritation. I took a day off of work that I didn't want to take off. I booked a last-minute flight that cost me a ridiculous amount. But uh, uh, I just felt like I had to be here, and I can't look in the face of my kids if I ever have any and tell them that I didn't do something, um, even if it was really a last-minute like this. Um, I think that if we, if we let this immigration shenanigans happen, that it could be the end of... America as we know it, and um, this is really, this is it. This is, this is the line in the sand, and I know we've kind of said that before with things like Obamacare and um, many other issues, Obama getting elected the second time, but um, I, I think that if, this, if these shenanigans are allowed to happen, we're never going to have any control of uh, the, the presidency for sure, the House, the Senate. It's all going to be controlled by progressive liberals and that's it but you got pride and you proud you do